Welcome friends. Let us solve the fourth part of question number one of exercise 3.5 of chapter 3. And the question says which of the following pair of linear equations has unique solution, no solution or infinitely many solution. In case there is a unique solution find it by using cross multiplication method. So let us solve this question. First of all we shall collect the given pair of linear equations that is x minus 3 by minus 7 equals to 0 and 3x minus 3 by minus 15 is equals to 0. Now we shall find the ratios a1 over a2 and b1 over b2 that is 1 over 3 and that is minus 3 over 3 this means 1 over 1 here we observe that a1 over a2 is not equals to b1 over b2 therefore the pair of equations has unique solution and now we shall find the unique solution by using cross multiplication method and for that first of all we shall write the given pair of equation linear equation in its standard form that is x minus 3y minus 7 equals to 0 say 3x minus 3y minus 15 equals to 0 we shall write x y and 1 here write the sign of equality here and now we shall start with b1 and b2 b1 is minus 3 b2 is minus 3 we shall write here c1 and c2 that is minus 15 we shall repeat this c1 and c2 under by like this and now we shall write a1 a and a2 a1 is 1 a2 is 3 we shall repeat this a1 and a2 and now we shall write this b1 and b2 here draw the sign of cross multiplication again write x y 1 write the sign of equality and now first of all multiply minus 3 with minus 15 then we have plus 45 write the negative sign and a bracket from your side same as here same as here and now multiply minus 7 with minus 3 then we have 21 positive 21 we, if we multiply minus 3 with 3 then we have minus 21 if we multiply 1 with minus 15 then we have minus 15 if we multiply minus 3 with 1 we have minus 3 if we multiply minus 3 with plus 3 then we have minus 9 and now we shall solve these values this is equals to 45 minus 21 this is equals to minus 21 plus 15 and this is equals to minus 3 plus 9 this is equals to x over 24 this is equals to y over minus 6 this is equals to 1 over 6 and now we shall write 1 over x over 24 equals to 1 over 6 and y over minus 6 equals to 1 over 6 this means x is equals to 24 over 6 this means 4 therefore x is equals to 4 we shall write y equals to minus 6 over 6 this means y is equals to minus 1 so this is the solution of the question thank you